Have you ever thought what it's like for a Reaper Alliance to come together? Well, welcome to Sea of Thieves. As you can see, I only have 180 hours, which is most likely a new player. So today I will show you what it's like for two Reapers to make an alliance for the whole server to go down. Oh, now now, hold your horses. Before we continue, I would like you to know who we're dealing with here. See, this guy, he's our friend, he's our alliance. Instead, this guy came in to break that alliance and I couldn't stand that, so I took off in helping my friend here. You would think that nobody will be this stupid to take on two reapers in an alliance while you were one man sloop, but no, this guy had the BOLT to do that. So you know how this ended, I guess. As soon as I saw him, I started shooting everything I had in my arsenal. I couldn't stand a fellow reaper being shot down by one of these kinds of people who can't control themselves and once they see a ship, they attacked it. It ended just as you might expect, his demise. Now don't think this is the last time we'll be seeing this guy or anyone else, this is just the start of an all out war on everyone. I went up on the crowds and I said I saw them on the horizon waiting to greet them. Once they came up to me I told them they can have their flag back but they told me I can keep it. Such good people you rarely see on the sea. We were chatting for a while and I wasn't reading the chat a lot, I was watching a video at that time but things started to go sideways when I saw this message. As I saw the message, I turned around and saw a brigandine coming towards us, definitely looking for a fight and not for an alliance. I went to my ship instantly raising the sails and started throwing everything I had on me, on a mission to not let my alliance sink like last time. As I left my ship, I saw their roots sinking so I decided to board them and help them carry everything back on their ship. We saw a brigandine coming closer on the horizon, so we decided it was time for us to return the favor, but until then they had our plans and sent borders. Until I saw the borders, I kept following them and then the border came and tried to anchor me, but to no avail. He thought that he could hide, but no more. His final bet was taken and it was time to take the fight elsewhere. We arrived at the fort of the dam, the fog was bringing even more stress to the fight, but alas, we ended them too. Heck, they even said GG and I told them I'm not done yet. We thought we won, we took all the other loot and we both leveled up our emissary flags, but again, this wouldn't be called Sea of Thieves if there weren't any thieves. Few moments passed and we were attacked once again, but this time it was an unmatched fellow. It took us half an hour to bring this guy down to the depths of the sea, but we won again and I was happily leaving to the Reaper Sahara to sell everything I gained that day. I thought that was a skelly ship, but it was the same guy from the fort of the damned. As I was selling my stuff, they killed me and took all my loot. I ended the day with leaving the outer sea into the sunset. It was a pretty good journey.